A Southeast New Mexico community is mourning tonight after two high school football stars got into a crash last night. One of them died. The other is in the hospital. Let's get to News 13's Gabe Chavez. Gabe, the community is coming together to help the victims' families. Right, Stephanie. The town of Dexter is hurting tonight. Despite that pain, they're coming together to help. The two teens in the crash, seniors Justice Sanders and Wyatt Garner, are described by community members as good kids, smart, and responsible. Both Sanders and Garner play for the Dexter Demons football team. Dexter Fire and Rescue Chief Justin Powell says the football team is struggling with the news, along with the rest of the community. Despite the overwhelming sadness, Chief Powell says they're still coming together to help the team and the teens' families. I want them to know we're all back at them. This um, entire community is, is going to back them, you know, and, and help them in any way we can. We want them to know that support is is there. When news of the accident made its way through town, Sanders and Garner, Cla Garner's classmates did not hesitate to step up, trying to organize a fundraiser for the families and a vigil for the team that died. Dexter High School principal Debbie Dumlau issued a statement earlier today, saying that counselors will be available for students and staff beginning on Monday. Members of the Dexter community are taking to social media tonight, offering their condolences to the Sanders family. But police have not identified Sanders as the teen that died. We're still working to learn more about the cause of the crash and the surviving victim's condition. Stephanie, back to you.